Today, Nikon have announced a very exciting 600mm f4 TC VR S line Z lens. Is it for Nikon Z cameras? It's for Nikon Z cameras with a built in 1.4 teleconverter. Okay, so let's talk about specifications, price, etc., etc. So, first thing that interests me personally is built in teleconverter. So, it's 1.4, so I assume it's 840 mil at 5.6 because it stops it down by one stop. But can you use it with other teleconverters? You can. You can add the ZTC 1.4 or the Z2 times converter on top of using the built in converter for even longer reach, which is great, I think. Fantastic. And then if you pair it down with the best camera in the world, which is Nikon Z9, which can focus at minus 7 EV now with the new firmware, then that's just going to be a clear winner. It's a dream team. Now, speaking of the Z9, the lens natively allows for five stops of VR with the Z9, which allows for synchro VR, you've got 5.5 stops of vibration reduction. Okay, let's talk about elements and groups because we love all that. So it's 26 elements in 20 groups. That's a lot of elements in a lot of groups, I can tell you that. That's right. And uh, those also include a miso amorphous coat. Mm, I love miso. You do, as well as a fluorine coat. And it is weather resistant, as you would expect with all Z lenses. It does have a new type of voice coil motor. This is called an SSVCM, a silky swift voice coil motor for extra silky swiftness. Silky smooth, I like that. Yes, okay. It's silky swift, so it's got a silky swift voice coil motor, which is apparently an even heightened version of the voice coil motor that we've seen in some of the other more recent lenses like the 402.8 VR Nikon Z lens. All right, but let's talk about weight. It's apparently three kilograms and 260 grams. Now, if we compare it to F-mount version, which is F4, FL, that one weighs 3.8 kilograms. So this one is 3.2. So about 550 grams difference there, which actually I think you will feel when you hand holding it. That's right. And because it is slightly lighter, it is hand holdable. And Nikon have actually shifted the center of gravity on the lens so that it's far more balanced and not too front heavy, which means you can use it both on or off tripod. So very similar to 100 to 400 lens, they implemented there and it won't put too much pressure on the mount of your camera. Precisely. The minimum focusing distance on this lens is 4.3 meters, while on the 600 f4 f mount version, it's 4.4 meters. So we do get slightly, ever so slightly closer at our closest focusing distance with this one. Now, it is released today, the 2nd of November, and will be due out to us by hopefully the end of the month. It's looking like around the 24th or thereabouts, at least in the UK and Europe. All right. And the price in UK is this. <laughs> Obviously, Grace of Westminster is a camera dealer in the United Kingdom. We'll stock this lens. And if you'd like to pre-order it with us, give us a call or give us an email. Give us an email. Give us an email. So, Register your interest yeah. online. We'll have more discussion about this lens on the podcast that will come out a couple of us later today. So come join us there where we'll discuss this lens in more detail. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.